Hi, I'm Dave and this is DG Overlanding. Welcome to our campsite review of Zebra Bush Camp. Zebra Bush Camp is in the Deniking Big Five Game Reserve, just a short distance from Pretoria and Johannesburg. Hi, this is Dave from DG Overlanding. Um, we're also now doing tours. So if you look at dgoverlandingtours.com, that's a website, you'll see information about all of our tours. We're touring to Botswana in November, and then next year we have six amazing tours planned. Have a look at that website. That's dgoverlandingtours.com. And join us. You'll enjoy it. Thank you. Bye. Right, we found Zebra Bush Camp. So we're going to go down here. It's no entry residence only. So we're a resident. Let's go and see what it's happening. Right, we're arriving at Zebra Bush Camp. This is their gate. And this over here is the bra area, the bra pit. So there's a bra, a uh, place to light a fire with stones and cement. It also comes with this um, drum that you put over your fire in the evenings when you go to bed so it doesn't blow into the felt. Very really good idea. And we have seen from here in the bush, on this side, we've seen zebras, wildebeest, um, waterbuck, impala, and lots of birds. Right, there's no power, so there's a donkey boiler. You light it up, they do supply a bag of wood a day for that purpose, to get hot water. And I must say, we have had really, really hot water. We haven't had a problem. This is the wash-up area, also hot water fed from the donkey boiler. Here's a bin. And on this side is the ablution facilities. It's open, there's no roof on it. It's quite nice, but it's, 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 it's enclosed. There's a little sign here. So if you do have other people, we're just on our own, so we haven't used it really. But if you do have other people, you put up the occupied sign when you're inside and uh, there we go. So there's a basin. Again, the hot water is coming from the donkey boiler and it's been very hot here, with the water that is. There's the toilet, normal flush toilet, no problems with that. And on this side is the shower. Very big area for shower. And the water pressure out of there is amazing. Hot water from the donkey and I haven't had a problem at all showering here. There is a shelf to put your goodies on, and there's a towel rack with hooks, and there's a tree. Right, so there's the shower. There's the entrance on this side. So, yeah, very good. And here's the mirror. You notice the hot and cold taps, the zebras. Little zebras on there, red one for the hot and the blue one for the cold. And this is the shower one, hot and cold. At night, it's wonderful, you're having a shower under the stars. Just the view out from the ablution facility, towards the donkey boiler, the wash up and the fry pit. So as I said before, there's no electric power, so we're using our solar panel, 300 watt, and it's charging two batteries that I have, one for the freezer and one for the fridge, and running our lights. Debra Bush Camp, they have a shop. You can get all kinds of goodies here. Cool drinks, chocolates, non-alcoholic drinks. There's a little couch, coffees if you need. And there we are. There's the counter in the shop. They sell wood, they sell ice.
Hi, so this is a Zebra Bush Camp. It's one of the fenced uh, campsites. There's a, a, boma, a, a boma here for a fire pit. There we are, it's the drum to put your fire in after, afterwards but before you go to bed. There's a fire grid, a bra grid, and a tap. Right, and on the other side is the wash up area and the ablution facilities over there. Right, so these facilities here have a gas, a gas geyser, so you can use the gas um, to wash up and also for the ablution facilities. And there's a solar light. And the last thing too is it has two points uh, on there. You can see them, the white ones. You can plug your cell phone in and charge your cell phone using the battery. Very good idea. Right, there's the wash up. Hot and cold water, double sinks on ice. And this side is a shelf where you can put all your goodies on. And then there's a dustbin and a broom over there. Right, and this is the ablution facilities. Again, with a sign that says occupied if, you, if you're in there. The gas geyser. There's a nice sink. Lovely sink. The toilet. Normal flush toilet. And the lovely shower. Hot and cold water. You see the little zebras. The red one for hot and a blue one for cold. Zebra bush camp. And there's the shower head. Very good. And this is the site. It's, it's a very big site. You can fit a lot of um, trailers on it or a caravan. And don't forget there's no uh, power. You must bring your solar panel and your battery. But there's heaps of sun, so there's no problem with that. So there's three tent stands inside, and this is inside the fenced area. We were staying at the unfenced, but this is fenced. Tents one, two, and three. All right, this is Zebra Bush Camp Stand 3. There are three stands. Um, stand 2 has people in it, so we're not going to go there. But there is a rooftop tent set up on a stand in um, Stand 2. So if you haven't got a tent, it's no problem. So there's the outside wash-up area. It's also got a gas geyser. Right. Toilet. And again, the solar lights, machine or the, or the gadget so you can charge your phone. You can see just out of the shower area is the fire pit, the fire boma. This one has a nice view out. There's a little spray to flay in the front here. So you see the animals coming down to the water. All right, so there's the, again, the drum, which is a very good idea for the fire when you go to bed. The fire grid, tap behind there. Right, and this is site number three. Very big site again. But there's also a little splash pool. Um, they are going to build some more. But for now, this is the splash pool. So it's big enough to get wet and cool in. It really is nice. This tent, if you don't have a tent, they will pitch this tent for you. Um, on a campsite, there's a double bed inside as well, so you can have that um, to come camping in if you don't have your own tent. Zebra bush camp. Thank you.